Hello everybody, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. So before I start playing, I just realized, uh... I can go back and look through the missions, and they also got... Like, a checklist. Kind of like GTA 5, so... It's pretty cool. Oh, can you even see these in the game, where does it tell you after you beat the mission what you have to do? Somehow I did all these. Lucky, lucky me. Okay, anyway, we are on our way with Dutch to go rob a train. This should be fun. How nice. The train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're going to pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer that run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Great. Yay. No problem with that. Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself. Hey, what are you going to be doing, Dutch? After Bill blows the tracks, we're going to need to move past. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Dutch is the kind of guy who will... Play the plan out, then sit back with a cigar and just watch it all fall apart. Because it's never gonna go as easily as it says it is. He is. What? I don't know. Let's rob this train. Out of the snow, finally. Feels good, doesn't it? But we need to get this done fast. Now it's thawing before anyone gets up here after us. After playing Assassin's Creed, I'm so used to the horse traveling by itself. Lenny's last name is here. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Oh, he's gonna die. Stay calm. Keep your eyes short. That goes for all of you. No so nice to be out of snow. Look how beautiful this is. Then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back, and that's the end of it. Okay, Dutch. Money safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money, once we work out how to cash them. What if we can't? Now everyone, shut up and get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. It's not even money, it's bonds. Oh, there's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. So are we going to, like, jump on it, or is it going to stop? Or right now, we're going to detonate the tracks. Right. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Do I have a choice? Okay. Come, Bill. How's it going, Bill? You doing okay? How you getting on? Yeah. yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can you I double sure? Yeah. All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Wait, where's the spool by you? Okay. What was that? Did you hear that? It sounded like a big animal. Maybe a bear. Maybe even a wolf. Okay, let's just do this. Uh, so you press the lever down, right? When you want it to go. Connect wire. Okay, this is good. All right, that should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. I wish there was a. Button you can press. 
to blow it right now. <laughs> Obviously, that would be the end of the mission or it'd fail you. But it would just be funny if they put it in. Don't need you distracting me here, I'm leaving. Shut up, Bill. You die in the first cave. Well, what are you doing, Carlton? Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Is train even coming? Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. The train should be here any minute now. Items. Oh, I got the bandana. Oh, didn't they have this in the first one? Time for a good old fashioned train robbery. Yeehoo! You all know what to do. Here we go. Go, Bill, go. Run, boys. <laughs> We're just gonna hop on. Yep. All right, time to improvise. Like I said, the plan never works. Here we go. Oh, he fell. Damn it, Javi. Micah, is that you? All right, now, Lenny. I'm trying. Oh. Oh. Come on. Would you even hit that? Yeah, he fell. Well. What? Oh. Whoa. Oh. 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 Who the fuck do you think you're shooting at? Ow. I don't think so. Bitch. I'm like a walking tank. Hey, take cover again. There we go. I'd like to see you try. You're fighting against the great Arthur Morgan and Lenny. Lenny here. I think he's dead. What the hell was Bill doing? He had more than How do you reload? Well, I hooked up the wire, but we won't mention that. Hey, what can I take here? We have to stop this train. Let's Miracle tonic. He said, did I screw it up? Oh shit, this guy's still alive. Is he? No. Who did that? You don't rob a oh, I don't think so. Get back here. I want to melee this guy. Bitch. Oh. Alright, we're almost there. Oh. Boom! Saved your ass. Well, at least we don't have to walk. Who's this guy? Man, that's a lot of them. Nope, they won't. Just bonds. Good 
Oh, it's even a better plan. They get to come up from the back. God damn. Now those guys riding up on horses? Oh, no, it's our guys. Never mind. That's time they caught up. Hey, Dutch. How's it going? Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. That's shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four, three, two, one. That was a bad countdown. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. Hell yeah. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Okay then. Thank you. Now don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Alright, super glue that on. Now light the fuse. Here we go. Better out run like hell. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. What happens if I stand right in front of it? Will I come two face? Hands up. All right, come on. Let's walk on out here. We don't want to kill you. My we just want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. I'm trying. I can't go. There's an invisible wall. Come on. You can go in there, Arthur. There you go. Look at this place. It's like a palace. Now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. Ooh, a letter. You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Oh, that's yeah, cursive. kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's king. Letter to Cornwell from Leland Oil Development Company. Dear Mr. Coinwell, we are yet to receive a payment of $2,000 for the initial phase of exploration at the Wet Wapiti Indian Res Reservation and Berino as agreed in the contract between Corwell, Kerosene, and Tar and the Leland Oil Development Company. I'm trying to talk. You guys shut up. Dated November 9th. Okay. I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can okay. read. Give me those. Railroad contracts, invoices, blah, blah, blah. Uh, another letter. Not really. All right, if you want to read this, pause it right there. Spanish West Indies. Flip it. A lot of sugar. Nothing. Some fancy new boat he's ordered from Europe. <laughs> I am not robbing another boat as long as I live. All right, what do we got down here? Brandy. Ooh, a lockbox. I found something. What was that? Is that it? I got one bond. Hang on, I ain't done yet. Ooh, cigar. Alright, that's it. Are you done in there? Nope. Twenty five dollars? God damn. Now I'm the richest guy in the world. Oh, oh. Let's hurry this along now. Shut up, Dutch. I'm taking stuff. Alright, I'm good. What did you find? These 
Bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Get on the train. Quick. All of you. Any bright ideas, I kill all three. So behave. Come on. Get on there, dude. What are you doing? Tell us all, I swear. Get oh. on the train. Okay, how do I start this? Alright, you put coal in the furnace, right? Or you just flip the switch? Alright boys, have a good trip. I would have killed them, but they didn't do me any harm. You know, they're just trying to get by like we are. If they had a gun on them, I would have shot them right between the eyes. We're going east. So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. No, you weren't there. Pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. Well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. John, you are a half-dead corpse. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. So I think that's the intro of the game. Now three parts in. God damn. I think now it's gonna start picking up. In case you didn't know, I was in the opera. God, they're still going. Alright, I'm done. Lenny! Micah, get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Where were those gates? Alright, that was weird. Get us out the stream. I'm trying, man, alright? You wanna take the reins? Be my guest. Ah, of course. Okay. Let's take a look. Nah, we're screwed. Let's just walk. Does everything look alright? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. Alright, let's get it fixed. You need help? Uh, yeah, lift it up. I reckon we can handle it. Yeah. All right, you lift that up by yourself. Hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a leg? Shut up. I'm just saying. Well, say less. Pick the wheel up. Boom. Boom. Nearly there. All right, now the other wheel pops out, right? Yeah, much easier to fix a wheel back in the old days. Not quite. Uh, 
Ah, oh, shit. Who's that? What do you think? If they wanted trouble, oh. we wouldn't have seen them. Hi. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Story time. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. Uh, why did everyone else leave us? Follow the river, then cut left inland. Go to Horseshoe Overlook. So, yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. So that bottom bar, is that like your wanted level? They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them it was, every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Are they ever pleasant? pleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't, in spite of Dutch's talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, Talking about me. don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. So... What happened to your trap? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. But when we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. I am hot. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. Oh, you could change clothes? That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Where they actually Maybe matter? A little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait. I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. You as the protagonist of the first game, I had to wait till the second one. It's complicated. We still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes. Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls, our kind of place. I should go there. Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait, but what's it called again? Valentine. Never mind. A place to lie low? It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? Oh, it's a rabbit. It's just, you know. Maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that ferry job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. Damn, how far did they get? What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. I've acquired some herbs. Alright, so you can pick plants. 
to learn about them. Is that how it works? You just pick up a plant and you know everything about it? American Gensing. Gensing? I don't know. How much farther is this? Horseshoe, where are you at? It's like driving in first person. Oh, where are you? Hey. Up. Oh, okay. How come they left you behind? What if we never came around here? Okay, let's go. Oh, I probably could have left you, couldn't I? Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Nah, yeah, just wait. Something bad's gonna happen. Always does. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. This is Horseshoe Overlook? You weren't wrong, Jose. This place is perfect. Are. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now, now Jinx. it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Jose. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a long way from a dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam in a few months. Buy some land. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Who are you? Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. <laughs> I'm first, I'm sure suckers. Everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Or steal it. Miss Jackson! Shit with more common sense than you do it properly. Sleep, shave, or change clothes at your tents. So can you like grow beards instantly? Chapter two Horseshoe Overlook. How many chapters are there? It took us three parts to get to chapter two. Hopefully it goes on like twenty. A couple of weeks later. Achievement. Back in the mud. Got off the mountain, rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling. Damn, look at that beard. I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. Spot of black water and that whole mess. 
Arthur. Oh, what's up? Jose. Eat, drink, and rest to maintain your course. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> Which one? Fifty Shades of Bark? Okay. Wow, there are a lot of objectives or waypoints on the map now. So how far did we travel? Can we have just gone straight to Valentine? Like, why do we have to go all the way around it? That makes no sense. What is that? Right, Reverend. So I think the yellow ones are our main missions. Javi. Before I end this episode, I just want to go check out and see what this is all about. I want to see what an actual town looks like. Oh, is there another mission here? Uncle. Okay, let's go check out the town quick. Oh, Arthur, my boy. My hey, dear boy. did your hair get gray? Does your beard actually get longer if you don't shave it? We're free. We're free to plan our own futures once I don't want to shave my beard at all. You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. And I ain't losing it now. Alright, so you can bring Pearson animals, so you can use the skins to craft satchels with increased supplies. Ammo, for provisions, and health supplies can be found uh, around the camp. The current stock levels are shown within the tithering box. Okay. Oh, hey, Jack. You're Jack, right? What are you doing over here? Hang on. Can I talk to you? Jack, you okay, man? You know, you're going to be a killer one day, just like your father. Okay. Horse can get dirty? Huh. Alright, how do I brush it? Probably do it when I'm off it. Yeah, this place looks nice. Blacksmith. I'm not gonna worry about side missions right now. Hitch horse. What? 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 Whoa, what? what'd I do? What? Shit. Oh, run, run. I'm going, I'm going. What did I do? Oh, I kicked. God damn it. I was, <laughs> I was trying to hit your horse. I think I kicked a piece of wood. Okay, I'll wait for it to go back down. I don't have a brush. Uh, can I feed you? You hungry? There you go. Alright, I'll try and buy a brush. Alright, I can go back there now. See if they even sell it. Am I good now? Are right, you guys... Oh, I'm sorry. So sorry, doggy. You got my way. No! I didn't do anything, alright? You got my way. Okay, I'm not wanted yet. Hey, try going around people. Shut up. Welcome, welcome. Come on in. Hi. I'm bath. Is that for me or is that my horse? You arrange a bath, I need a wash. I got someone warming it up for you already. Just head down the corridor there. Jack? That Jack Patello? Sounds like him. I heard he was in the game, but... Yeah. Uh, where did you say? Down the corridor? Huh. Yeah, I heard, uh... 
If you don't know who that is, Jack Patello from Achievement Hunter. I heard he was in the game, and I heard Jeff Ramsey, another fellow from there, was also in the game. Didn't think you'd meet him so soon. <laughs> you can actually scrub. Okay, might as well do everything. Scrub my right arm. Scrub, 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 scrub. Can I be of any assistance in there? Yes. Ooh la la. Oh, sounds good. Yeah. Thanks. Hello. Can relax, hon. Oh. Why, thank you. You'll leave this place feeling brand new, you know. Why are you reaching down there so much? Uh, I was nearly married once. She never bathed me. Let's just keep that between us and these four walls, shall we? Yeah, will do, lady. Uh, we don't like strangers much in this town. Yes, that's how it is around here. Always been. It looks like you're doing something down there. Uh, I do not like getting older. Like I said, I was going to end the video when I got here and I'm taking a bath. Uh, this is the first time I've been able to relax in ages. Oh, gosh, you poor thing. Yes, I'm so sad. Keep touching me. Let's see, there isn't much to do here except count the stars, you know? What was that? This is kind of getting awkward. Oh, you do feel tense. I can't do anything else except exit. All right, I think that should do it. Oh, hello. It was nice meeting you. Thanks for the kiss. No, oh, that was nice. Wish it would have gone farther, but okay. Uh, I want to try something quick. Can you save the game and then load it? That's the thing you could do, right? So then you can just load it back. Okay. Now I want to try something real quick. Uh, I can't do business with anyone with a mask on. Sorry. You saw nothing. Give me it. Give me the money. Come on, Jack. Whoa, whoa! A gun is not the answer. Yes, it is. Give me the money, man. Can I take your money? Why are you doing this? Hold on. I can't hogtie you? Oh, I was gonna try and hogtie him. I can't pull my weapons. Alright. Uh. That's it! Someone's going to jail! Sorry, Jack. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, I knocked your glasses off. Nerd. Oh! I'm so sorry. God damn. I didn't know we could decapitate them. Oh, can you take, take, take their limbs off? Hey, hold on, guys. I'm experimenting. What about your fingers? Can I help you? Who's do- Who broke the window? Hey, what's going on? Oh! 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 My hat! Bitch! Kill y'all! <laughs> Bitch! Who did, who shot me? Come here, you. Oh, I got a bounty of $70. How dare you shoot me? Okay, well, I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to do down below. <laughs> leave a like, subscribe, share. Oh. And I'll see you all in the next part. My hat. Where's my hat? All right, sorry. I want to test it now. Can I load back? It's before I shot him. Well, I'm outside. Is he still alive? Wait, I don't think this is the right place, is it? No. I think he's on this side. 
Jack. Quick, huh? You're alive. Okay. Oh, wait. I'm gonna try something else now. Really quickly. Thanks, yes. Hey! Next time, you're out. Shut up. Come oh, here. No. Please help me, God! <laughs> Please help me, God! Come here, Jack. It's so funny. It's because I watch so much Achievement Hunter. I know, like, a lot about them. I can't pick them up or anything. Uh, I'll cut you free. How's it going? Are we good? I'm try you leaving. Going back. Hey, how's it going? The I don't want this. Sure you do. Come on, let's go. Oh, whoops. Hey, no one gonna help me. Let's have some fun. Come on, pal. Yeehaw! Lord, save me. <laughs> Please don't. Oh, he's getting all dirty. What the don't worry, I've got him. Give him a little bath. This was <laughs> that guy's ragdolling too. It's like, God, it's like not even like a body. It's like a floaty corpse. Ow! Ow! Hold on, I'm trying to play with him. All right, let me talk to you quick. All right, have fun. <laughs> See ya. Okay. Uh, oh, what the fuck happened? Okay, goodbye. Okay, I gotta stop. <laughs> goodbye.